Hi guys, I wanted to create somewhat of a short video on EMF. It's a very big topic, so this is just to increase your awareness if you've never heard about EMF before, electromagnetic fields, okay? It's um, basically, there are certain waves of energy that can damage our DNA. Some people are more sensitive to these waves than other people. Um, however, um, your smartphone, Wi-Fi, your router, <laughs> in your house with your uh, wireless, uh, microwaves, Bluetooth, computer and screen, your recharger, the one that you recharge your phone right by your head of the bed, right when you're sleeping, all give out certain fields of energy that can affect your body, okay? This is a little sensing device right here, okay, that can pick up electromagnetic fields, okay? So you can get one of these if you want. And I'll show you cell phone. You can see that it goes off pretty intensely when, yeah, right through in here. So closer you are to your head, you can create problems. Uh, the problem is when you do research on this, you're going to see that it says it's safe. Science, science said it's safe. Just like asbestos was safe for 99 years, and so was trans fats for 60 years, and smoking was safe for about 46 years. It's just a matter of time. But I see the problem because if it was out there that this created damage, could you imagine like all the different problems that could happen with the manufacturing companies? And I'm not saying, I don't want to scare people, I don't want to freak people out, but it can affect your sleep, your energy. It can increase your risk of getting a brain tumor, glioma, by three times if you're using this over a long period of time, very close to your head. So when you use your phone, use this speaker, okay? Try to keep this away from your head as much as possible. So when I talk on my phone, I use earbuds. I don't like talking in the phone very much. Maybe if I have to, but I don't like it. Um, but make sure that you order the AirTube headset, okay? There's different kinds you can get. So that way it doesn't have the EMF connecting wire that's driving the energy right into your head. Uh, it's actually hollow and it's much safer. You can find these online, um, search out ones that have good reviews and get one of those. That way it can decrease the EMF to your brain. So I put some links down below. So you can minimize the damage in your house and your office. So definitely check them out. This is measuring EMF, oh, wow. magnetic fields. Hey, before you leave, I just wanted to give you a little quick history on some of the books that I wrote. This was one of the first books. It's called Dr. Berg Body Shapes. It was my attempt at um, writing about body types. Uh, what was very interesting about this book is I actually did all the images myself. Uh, don't ask me why. Um, they look actually not quite as professional as some of the uh, images that I have in the new book. But anyway, this is my first attempt right here called Dr. Berg's Body Shape Diets. Uh, and then I wrote a book um, more extensive called The Seven Principles of Fat Burning. I don't even have a copy anymore, actually, um, because it's outdated. Uh, the next book, uh, I put about a thousand hours into this one right here called The New Body Type Guide. Major updates on the body types. Uh, I put a lot of energy into this. Uh, it has professional images, graphics, all sorts of things. Now, the problem with this book is it doesn't really describe what this is really about. Body types are only a small portion of what's in this book. And that's why I changed the name to the Healthy Keto Plan, okay? If you happen to have this book, you don't really need this book because there's some only very, very minor updates. But if you don't have this, you need to get this one right here. Um, this book goes into every single detail that you would ever want to know about. It goes into the seven principles of fat burning. It goes into hormones. 
uh, the body types, the basic keto plan. It goes into intermittent fasting. I talk about the 10 fat burning triggers and blockers and fat burning strategies with a lot of details in every single chapter. I go into body issues that interfere with losing weight. Um, there's very few people that just have a weight problem. They have a lot of body issues, whether it's sleeping problems, uh, stress problems, inflammation, menopause. I cover that extensively in this book. Then I talk about how to get rid of stress and I show you a technique. Uh, then I get into exercising. And then I have a lot of really good recipes in this book as well. So uh, this is a good reference guide. Um, on my website, if you get this book, you get this one free. It's called Healthy Keto intermittent fasting. This is the shortcut, uh, quick guide to this book. And uh, the reason I created this book is to have you within 45 minutes, learn how to do keto, okay, in intermittent fasting, exactly what you need to do. Then you can fill in the blanks with this book right here. So right now I'm doing a special, if you get this book, you get this one totally free, or you can go to Amazon and get these individually. So I just want to clarify the difference between this book and this updated one right here. If you don't have this, you need to get this right here. That way you can get the exact correct information to do it healthily.